Here with me today at Chatswood's Terry White Pharmacy is Dr Lynn Weeks, NPS Medicine Wire CEO, to discuss how you can reduce medicine-related side effects and take an active role in your healthcare. Good morning, Lynn. Hi, John. Now, when you manage your medicines carefully, or if you're managing them carefully, or those of an older person you might be looking after, it's a big responsibility and it's extremely important to know that there can be side effects from those medications. Yes, as you get older, there are quite a number of changes in your body that impact on how you deal with medicines. Older people are often taking more than just one type of medicine. Some will be taking a mixture of prescription, over-the-counter and complementary medicines. And when taking multiple forms of medication, unwanted side effects are more likely to occur. That's why we recommend a regular review of your medicines to check with your doctor whether any new symptoms or changes in how you feel could be due to the medicines themselves. Now, various changes in the body as you grow older may affect how your body processes, removes and reacts to medications, meaning you may need more or less of some medicines than you did before, or you may even need to stop taking a medicine. That's right, John, and that's why we recommend a medicines review for people to make sure you're on the right medicine and the right amount of medicine. Now, when you consider that older people may see different doctors and go in and out of facilities or mm. hospitals, is there an easy way to keep track of the medicines that they're actually taking? Mm, yes, John. Serious problems may arise when people are going in and out of healthcare facilities or are being prescribed different medicines or simply different brands of medicines they're used to. When someone has a number of different health professionals looking after them, like a GP and a specialist, who are all prescribing and recommending different medicines, it can get very confusing for everyone. So keeping an up-to-date medicines list is a good way around that. And don't forget, show that medicines list to your family. Give them a copy so they're in the loop as well. Now, despite the real value of the medicine list, some older people may not be taking the medicines as they're supposed to. What are the things that people can do in these circumstances to assist? There's a, a range of reasons people don't take their medicines as, as they're supposed to. They may simply forget or they may be feeling unwell due to side effects. If they're forgetting, a dosing aid from the pharmacist is a really good way to help them remember to take the right amount of medicines on the right days. Yeah, now, Lynn, dosing aids are where all the medicines are laid out simply day by day with instructions on how to take them. Mm, that's right. Now, if you're not taking your medicine because of unwanted side effects, well, what, what should someone do? Mm, it's really important to talk to your doctor and tell them about the medicine um, problems that you're having. Also tell your pharmacist what the problem is because there might be another medicine that will work better for you and cause less problems. Now over one in four adverse drug events in older people could be prevented so what are the important ideas that older people taking medicines should keep mm. in the forefront of their mind? We're really recommending that people have and, and their carers talk to the health professionals about the treatment they're taking, what it should achieve and by taking that time to have regular conversations you can find medicines that will work better for you and have fewer side effects. Now people can always call the NPS medicines line if they have any questions about their medicines. Communication after all is the key to managing and making sure mm. that you're having good and solid health. So uh, how can you be sure that you're taking your medication safely? Absolutely. An NPS pharmacist um, can be contacted on the phone. They'll be very happy to talk to you about your medicines and the problems you might be having. Lynn, great tips. Thanks for joining us on The Morning Show. Thanks, John. It's been a pleasure. And it's back to you guys. We're here to share the morning with you.